Today in our 2016 Audi Q5, we're doing a test fit of the Yakima Holdup Platform Style 2 bike rack. That part number is Y02443. Now we already have our bike secured down. I'm first going to show you one of the key features of this rack. We're going to come here to the back and pull out on our lever while lifting slightly up on our rack. And we'll be able to tilt this fully loaded with our bikes away from our vehicle. You'll see we're going to have just enough clearance there. We're not going to have to worry about making contact with our bike. And we're going to be able to get anything in or out that we may need at this point. What's great about this is that we don't have to worry about removing our bikes or our bike rack from our vehicle just to gain that access. And then with that closed up, we'll just lift back up until it clicks into place. Now how our bike is secured down here at the back, we have a ratchet strap. We're going to pull up on this red tab here to release that and then use the black portion to ratchet that down. At the front we have a wheel hook. Now this is going to sit either in front of our brakes or in front of our frame depending on how our bike is made. And this also has an integrated cable lock at the top to help to prevent theft and tampering of your bike. We're going to push on our red button to release it and then pull straight down to tighten that down. Push that hook off to the front. We could take our bike off and set it off to the side. Now we have a specific way of folding this up into a more compact position. We're going to take our front wheel cradle, fold it back. Our back wheel cradle is going to tilt on top of our front. Then we'll take our hook, pull it all the way to the back, and ratchet that down. Now we'll take a few measurements here. First, overall, what we're adding to our vehicle, we're going to have about 30 and a half inches. Ground clearance is going to be about 18 inches, and our closest point is going to be about 6 inches. Now again, in this position, we can gain full access to our hatch, but we're just going to move on, pulling out on our red pull tab. We're going to fold this up against our vehicle. Not going to have to worry about our closest point in this position. This is going to be great for close quarter situations like parking. We've got about 11 and 3 quarter inches added to our vehicle and about 12 and 3 quarter inches of ground clearance. Now as for our hitch, this is designed to work with two inch hitches only. We have an anti-rattle bolt and lock. That lock's going to help to prevent theft and tampering while that anti-rattle bolt, when tightened down, is going to keep a lot of shake and play out of the bike rack as you head down the road. So that's going to be our completed look at the Yakima Holdup Platform Style 2 Bike Rack, part number Y02443 on our 2016 Audi Q5. This is our test course. Let's start with the slalom. This shows side-to-side -side action such as turning corners or evasive maneuvering. Then onto our alternating speed bumps. This shows twisting action such as hitting curbs, potholes, road debris, or uneven pavement. And last of all, the solid speed bumps. This shows up and down action, such as driving through a parking lot or parking garage, or driving in and out of a driveway. Click the link below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com.